I'm so excited that right for Christmas. I freaking can't wait. Oh yeah, these are my favorite. Look cute. Ah! Um, I think this jacket in white would be so freaking cute, but one pump sugar-free vanilla, two pumps peppermint syrup. Good morning, YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Janina Mapola. You are watching me as I get ready to go work out. I'm just putting on some concealer today because I got some breakouts because the time of the month is here. But uh, welcome back to my channel. Hello, my name is Janine. If you are new here, welcome. Um, I post weekly vlogs every Monday. Finally back on a schedule, which is great. I was not for a very long time, but we're back, baby. I got to leave for the gym in literally four minutes. So I was just quickly putting on a little bit of concealer because like I said, it's the time of the month. I'm about to break out. I am I am breaking out. Uh, I'm drinking some pre-workout, which that's a new thing for me. If you've been watching me for a long time, you know I'm a coffee psycho fanatic, but in the mornings, it's super weird. I find myself not wanting it as much. Now, not to say I don't want it, but I don't like it being like coffee. It's the first thing I need. Well, let me wash my teeth first. Okay, we're back. But uh, yeah, I used to be, I mean, not used to, I act like this was literally like a year ago. This was, I only changed this maybe even like two weeks ago. Um, I've been drinking pre-workout before my workouts because honestly, whenever I drink coffee and I put the coffee creamer in, I don't feel like it gives me the energy I need for a workout. I do feel like it also makes me feel a bit bloated. Like I just don't feel my best working out after drinking coffee. I just feel good after drinking pre-workout. So cheers. This is the one from Alani New. Here's what I'm wearing today. I'm just put this bra on from Fabletics. These old Lou lemon leggings, like like old, like from college, old. And I'm gonna show you guys what shoes I'll wear later, but let's go work out. Okay, I actually changed my bra because the other one was more of like a loungewear bra. It's not like a workout bra, which meant there would be no support for the girlies and that would be an issue. Okay, let's go work out. I don't know what we're doing today, but we'll see. So it is 46 degrees right now, which isn't like the coldest. And I know if you live in like a colder state, you're probably like, that ain't that cold. But for us Texans, this is pretty cold. Dallas just was like, frick you fall. No one cares about you. And then just wanted to go straight to winter. Anyway, all I was trying to say is it's cold. It's not fall anymore. It's not like the pretty like 60 degree where you can just wear like a light, light coat. No. It's 44 degrees right now on my little car temperature meter, which is kind of cool because like I do like winter fashion. I like the fall fashion. I love all that, but we're going straight into Christmas, which means I need to decorate for Christmas soon. So I need to see what I have and then probably order some more stuff because I feel like some of my decor I bought like four years ago. It just it ain't very cute no more. Also, this album, so good. Check out this album, it is unreal. Alrighty, I am at Vive. I need to bring the sports bra from an, other, an older gym. Oh, my tag is sticking out, that's cute. So I'm wearing this, we're doing kind of like a full body type of thing where it's like legs, arms, abs, and you do each one for 45 seconds on, and then like 45 seconds off, and then you do three sets. So I'll show you guys what we're doing today, let's go. Hello everyone, I finished my workout. I picked up a Starbucks today because I didn't have coffee this morning actually. So I drink a coffee afterwards to keep me sane of course. And I got the, uh, what is it? Grande Latte, oat milk, which they, they're out of almond milk. I love almond milk. One, pup, one pump sugar-free vanilla, two pumps peppermint syrup. Very good. Mm. So, Anyway, I'm getting ready right now for a meeting I have in 20 minutes. And then I am prepping for a podcast I'm filming. So I'm pre-filming now for season four. I'm on a little break from my podcast right now, but I'm still pre-filming and getting all the content for that. So when I do launch again, I believe I'm launching the season four of Happy and Healthy on January 17th. Um, Cause that's gonna be the Tuesday that's in the middle of the month. Then 
I will have content ready to go. So I'm going to be filming that today. Have to work on something else today. I would like to decorate for Christmas. I don't know if I'm going to fully be able to do that today, but I'm going to at least pull things out and like prep for that and look at what I need and like what I need to order and stuff. But so that's what I'll be doing afterwards as well. And yeah, that's my agenda for today, but I'm just getting ready. Um, um, on my Instagram, I was going to show some of my most favorite makeup products, which if you follow or check out my like to know what I'm going to have links always on there because I was going to post all my like most recent favorites soon on there. And this mascara, my favorite, I've talked about this before. It's the Monsieur Big Lancome Lash. They are selling two of these, two full sizes for $31 at Nordstrom right now, which normally one is $28. So that's a deal. So the link will be down below or just check my like to note. The link is always my like to note on there. And yeah, I'm going to continue getting ready. As I'm getting ready, I'm watching the the Shane Dawson uh, Jeffree Star documentary, The End of Jeffree Star, which is kind of crazy. I, I get what he's saying about YouTube. I mean, yeah, he's basically saying he wants to quit because no one's watching it anymore. And I feel that sometimes. I'm like, oh, everyone's on TikTok, which I'm on TikTok, but it's not the same, you know? Like, I can't just sit and talk to a camera on TikTok forever and feel the same connection with y'all. And so as a creator, it definitely can be a little frustrating when you're like trying to navigate and figure out which platform do I need to use and where's everyone gonna go and stuff. So I don't know, but I still love the vlogging process. So you will still see me popping up on your feed every single Monday. <laughs> okay, so I finished my meeting. I'm prepping for a podcast and I am using my spare room for a potential podcast room, which is kind of exciting. So I don't know what I'm gonna do quite yet, but I'm gonna try to figure out like a, a cool backdrop because I've been wanting to have like a separate room for my podcast a long time already. So I'm just trying to figure this out, but just testing some stuff out, but that's kind of exciting. Maybe a potential podcast studio in my house. This is so cute. So many candles, oh my goodness. Okay, so this is what I have so far. I'm getting a friend a birthday card for her birthday tomorrow. Got these cute little reindeers. This one's $5, which is great. Cute little thing for my front door. Some gold reindeers. I think these are so cute. And then this giant freaking stunning candle. So this is gonna be amazing. That is everything I am getting. Also somehow managed to get the world's noisiest shopping cart. <laughs> I'm so excited to decorate for Christmas. I freaking can't wait. Also, I apologize for me not bringing my camera to Target because filming on my iPhone just wasn't it. And th there was such a fiasco at the store. Like I was running around, I lost my freaking card and then someone gave it to me and I found it and then there was this issue with this freaking wreath that I got because it was messed up and the end they gave me it only for $15 when it was actually $30 so that was a nice thing and then there's this other lady that lost all her cards and I was helping her find her cards quite the fiasco but we're good I got some decor as I showed you guys and I'm gonna be making some dinner I'm gonna be doing like a ground beef kind of bowl I make this all the time it is so easy I'll show you guys how I do it Okay, don't mind my dishwasher, but here is the finished meal. I just drizzled everything on there. It's super simple, delicious, and a go-to meal. Enjoy.
Good morning, YouTube. Welcome back. Um, I think this is just a continuation, <clears throat> excuse me, into yesterday's vlog. Last night, I went to this thing at the Galleria Mall called Snow Day, which I'll insert some iPhone clips because it was so cute. Highly recommend. They invited me to it. I didn't know what to expect. Loved it. Like, I was like, this is so dang cute. So, did that. And um, I got home, obviously, duh. You don't need to know every single detail. <laughs> but anyway, it's a new day. It's Friday now. I am doing my quiet time. It is 8.20. I'm about to go on a walk with a friend that I haven't seen in like two years. Um, and then I got to shoot some content today. I'm going to a Mavs game tonight with a lot of friends. And then um, I'm going to do an unboxing. And then, yeah, I have my assistant coming over just to shoot some content. I got to clean up the house a little bit because... It got a little messy, so we got to work on that a little bit today. So that's what today's agenda is, but I'm shooting a brand deal with my assistant and just planning some content out for that, and I'm going to finish up having my quiet time, but that is my morning so far. Cheers. Look at this cute cup. I got it from Nordstrom. I saw it and just thought it was so freaking precious. I had to have it. Okay. Cheers, you guys. Oh, my sister's calling me. Bye. All right. I'm on my way to go to Katie Trail. I'm going on a walk. Like I said, it's about 47 degrees. So I'm deciding whether I want to wear my vest or not because I'll probably get hot. Um, but yeah, I'm going to Uptown, which is one of my most favorite parts of Dallas. It's so pretty. I'll try to show y'all safely, of course. All right, hello everyone. So it is now 4.29. I'm almost done with the work day. I was shooting a brand deal, preparing for that all day. So I did that and I just got a package from Abercrombie. So I'm gonna show you guys some things I ordered, just a little mini haul. Um, I know they're probably gonna have some good stuff on Black Friday. So you can probably just save these for whenever you do wanna shop on Black Friday. But yeah, I'm almost done with work. I'm gonna go to a friend's birthday dinner, the Mavs game. I need to figure out what I'm wearing, but I wanna show you guys these pieces really fast first. So let's do it. Okay, the first thing I got is this Lake Tahoe sweater, which I have been there four times. I used to go there regularly whenever I would go skiing with my friends in California. So this place just has fond memories. I think we're going again for this next year. Um, I don't know if I love the color, but I love the fit. They're so soft and I just love their logos. They do such a great job with their branding. So I wouldn't necessarily wear it with these jeans because I feel pretty Gen Z wearing this outfit. Um, and I almost wish I got a medium because this is a large, but it is so soft. I might exchange this. The next thing I got are these jeans actually. And I don't know if I love the wash. And also this is kind of interesting. I It came with a rip and I'm like, is it supposed to have that? Is that a trendy thing now? But I don't know if I want that, but Either way, they're really cute. I do love the fit. I have these in white and I loved the fit of the white ones, which is why I got these. So these are the first two pieces that I got. All right, so here are the next couple pieces. I got this beanie, which is very warm, very thick. The reason why I started shopping was because I'm going to Chicago December 8th and it is very cold there. So got some new jackets for that. I got this jacket right here, right here which I love how you can wrap it. Um, I think this jacket in white would be so freaking cute, but this shirt is not Abercrombie, but this is Aritzia. And then I got these black slacks, which I don't know if they fit me as well as I would want them to, but maybe y'all can let me know. But if I ever wanted to wear heels, I don't know if they'd be too short, but I think they're so cute. I have these in multiple different colors. Love the fit of these. They just feel a little extra tight but maybe because i'm bloated on my period um but i love these pants highly recommend these if you need any new business pants i should probably also dust off my mirror but anyway this is one thing and then i have two more jackets to show you guys okay this is the next one it's like a long parka jacket it's very thick it's pretty heavy the pockets are like fleece line which is so nice this will definitely keep me warm in chicago it's very cute so love this Okay, really bundling up here. I got this big oversized scarf. These are like really in right now when you like just throw one like that over you. I don't know, it's a look right now. Um, so I got this scarf in white as well as this plaid. And then I got this black parka jacket as well. This one isn't as thick and heavy as the other one, but it's very comfy. And I like that you can tie this so it cinches in more. Also will be good for Chicago, but that is everything that I got. Everything was 30% off, which is why I got it, but I would definitely um, check these out on Black Friday. So that's it.
All right. Hello from Nordstrom Rack. I haven't vlogged in a couple days. So sorry. We're back. I'm in Nordstrom Rack getting some Christmas gifts. And I was like, I haven't vlogged. So I worked at a coffee shop. I'm heading home soon to work a little bit more, but was by Nordstrom Rack. So I'm getting some little goodies. So that's what we're doing. And then I'm decorating for Christmas tonight. So it's day two. Okay, so I finished up my work day. It is now seven o'clock, probably like 7.15 now. And I'm about to start decorating for Christmas. My parents are gonna come over, they're gonna help me, but I gotta get all the decor out first before they get here. Um, I hope they're okay with helping me, but I told them that I was doing that and they seemed okay with it. So I cannot wait to decorate for Christmas. Let's do it. So I got the Christmas music in the background going. I'm about to get rid of my fall decor and we're gonna do this, yay. I set this up already. I just gotta turn on the cute little lights, but I set this up already last week or earlier this week. Okay, so I got my Christmas box out. I don't remember what I have already, so. We're about to find out. Okay, yes, I had this on my table last year, as well as this. Cute, okay, good. I do have little fillers for pots, which is good. I might add some to that one over there. Cute little trees. Oh, this is so good. Gifts that go underneath the tree. Cute, okay, so I do have some stuff, which I figured I did. Oh yeah, these are my favorite, look. Cute. <gasps> ah! I'm getting excited. Lots of candles. Oh, one of my favorites. I got this in California a while ago. Cute. Okay, so I do have quite a bit, which is good to know. Oh, I even had this. <laughs> I made this sign, which is funny. So you guys can see here, have a lot of stuff. Um, as I showed you guys, I already did that. These two little, you guys saw me get those are from Target. Target, the candles are from Amazon. And then I got some filling from Target as well, which I think I need to add something like in between. But I'm pretty happy with that so far. Okay, so I'm gonna start with my entryway table. I'm probably gonna remove these for now. Probably swap that. Deciding whether I wanna keep this pot or not. I just bought this pot and I really like it, but I gotta mess around with it a little bit. Have a little Christmas house I could do. Nothing is set in stone. We're just playing around right now. Okay, this is always my favorite thing to usually decorate is this. Does that look absolutely ridiculous? Probably does. Okay, I'm over in this little corner in my house. I also added these cute little lights, Amazon. Um, not really sure what to do here quite yet. I'm honestly just placing things. There's an ant that I just smushed and I'm gonna figure out afterwards, like if this is obviously really where I want it to go, which I'm really leaning towards no one majority of this stuff. So I don't know, I gotta figure this out what I wanna do. Stay tuned. In honor of Maddie, we're still gonna hang one for her. Now I'm trying to decide what I wanna do with my dining room table. I have this big candle from last year, which I need to clean it, but it's, it's Christmas scented. And this wreath that I can stick in the middle. And I'm just trying to decide if I wanna do what I did last year. I had a whole wreath go down the table, but I may wanna do that different this year. I just gotta mess around with it and we'll see. What happens? I also think my parents are here. And I think I'm gonna have them help me with the tree because that takes so much work. Okay, so my dad helped me put my tree up. My parents don't really wanna be on camera, so just, you know, we'll have to get a little sneaky with it. But anyways, I moved my tree over here, this side. Last I had it by the front door. I didn't like that. I wanna be able to kind of see it from the front window. And... I'm going to put the tree topper on. Really just, just get it in. Oh, snap. Did this go on this tree? Uh, oh, I remember last year I had to bend it. That's right. Come on now, don't be stingy now. Okay, well, I'm gonna fix that in a second. <laughs> um, but I really like the way it looks over here. So time to decorate. 
I moved some stuff to the garage and I'm kind of just reorganizing to get it the way I want it, but I like it in this corner a lot better. Yay. Okay, everyone, my mom and I are making hot chocolate. We've got Swiss Miss. My mom's pouring milk into, um, do you want to be on it? Hi, mom. Hello. Say hello to everyone. She's making um, the hot cocoa in the pot. That's a lot of milk, mom. That's a lot? That's too much. No, it's okay. Okay, whatever you want. Oh, maybe too much, okay. Maybe just a little too much. It's too much. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> and then she's cleaning my candle because there was black all over it. Yeah. Dad's over there on the tree duty. It was great teamwork. Okay, good morning everyone. It's the next day. I know this vlog is all over the place, but I'm gonna show you guys really fast all the Christmas decor that I did because I'm done and I can finally show it to you and then we were closing out this vlog, so let's do it. I, uh, I thought about adding a tree over there, a Christmas tree, because I did that last year. I'm a little lazy this year, so I may not do it this year, but that's cute for now. I'm in my robe, don't judge me. So this is what we did at my entryway table. Okay, on to the living room. Here is the Christmas tree. I moved it to this corner this year. Last year it was over there and I didn't like the way that looks, so I put it in this corner. It's a seven foot tall tree and my ceilings are eight foot, so the top, the topper doesn't fit, but I love my tree. I love the simplicity of like all the colors. I put some fake gifts down there, some random little ornaments that I've collected throughout the years I've made. Um, that one's from Kendra Scott, DCC Cheerleaders, Montana. So I will continue to get these, but I love my tree. In my cabinet little corner over here, um, I just put this. Honestly, not the biggest fan, but it works. I'm just going to leave it for now. It's 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 probably a little too much, but you know what? It's good for now. <laughs> and lastly, on my kitchen, I just added a little candle, a little tree, and then this decor as well. Okay, so that is everything. Um, some things are subject to change. I definitely feel like I want to redo a little bit of the furniture and decor in my house. Um, just because it's not it's not giving what I wanted to give anymore, but for now we're we're gonna keep it. But anyway, thank you guys for watching today's vlog. I know this was all over the place. It was so crazy and random, um, but it was so sweet to have my parents over and do Christmas decorations with them. I haven't done that with them since I was a kid, so it was really nostalgic for me, so I really loved that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching my vlog. I'm heading out of town, so I'm packing right now. I gotta go. I'll see you guys again next Monday for more now Christmas content and winter content. I cannot freaking wait. So see you guys next Monday. Thank you for watching. Love y'all, and peace out, Girl Scout. Bye, y'all.